Morning everyone, how you guys doing? Uh, I'm out here. Uh, it seems as though every time I decide I want to pull out the stuff to work on the van, it seems as though it decides to rain. It's kind of overcast and cloudy today as you can see behind me here. Okay, anyway, so the uh, van is looking to take a little bit of shape. Uh, put some glue on down, working on the back section moving forward. This is the actual bed. Um, meant that I have four. The bed area is not going to work being this height, which is like a 20 inch thing. So what we're going to do, since we have the high top, what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually raise the bed to where it is even with the back windows. And we're going to, you know, block off the windows anyway. But the bed will actually be this height and then we'll have chairs and the uh, dinette set that I'm going to build in the front. So project today is um, take out the bed that I already built and raise it up to the back window. So, so I've purchased my wood. And like I said, this is the basics to it, and I'm going to raise it up to the windows. There's my extra wood. I'm framing it on the bottom, on the sides, with uh, two by twos. Uh, they were nice enough to, where I purchased the wood, uh, cut them all the same length that I need it for, so it's just that much less hassle that I have to deal with. And I've got me some different type of screws that I'm going to use to put them in with, uh, regular drywall screws. But uh, so now the next step is it looks like it's going to start to rain just a little bit. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to disassemble the bed with the frames and move all my equipment out from underneath it and then start raising it after I get done. First, like I said, I have to take everything apart. We're going to the lumber yard. To Why? Buy, to buy more lumber yard, to, more, to buy more lumber for the bed to finish it. I have to get a piece for the front. Uh, I have to get, um, well, I'm actually going to put some metal framing underneath it. You know, we raised it, and uh, I don't want to go any higher than what it is. And it, this is my third time. Let me roll this up in case you can't hear me. Well, this is going to be a quick one, so just wrap yeah. it up. Third time's a charm. I threw the bed in first. It really wasn't done the way that I wanted it to be done. Uh, so I tore it apart and put it in again, and it was nice and sturdy and solid, but um, too low, like we said. Now this time here is the third time, which we've raised it up. Now I want to do some finishing touches on it and be done with it and move on to the next project. Like I said, here is the finished product of the bed, finally. What we did was we brought it out. It's uh, six foot, and coming in this way, uh, four foot, six by four. I know that doesn't sound like a lot uh, of bedroom for myself as, and Sally, so because we, we require more. Anyway, but we, like I said, what we did is we raised it up uh, to the base of the windows, uh, which gave us a uh, considerably amount considerably a lot more uh, room to uh, store the stuff that we need underneath there so and as you can tell because it being an extended van we really haven't gone that far uh, using that much of the wheel wells yet 